Today's project is to make some uh, fixture clamps um, for my fixture plate. Um, the clamps are going to be made out of this uh, sort of 10 by 15, just mild steel, nothing special. Um, there it is, it's about 15 millimeters wide with a slot in and some cap screws. There's, there'll be a thread in, in one end and the cap screw in the other. Um, this actually shows the channel going a bit too far, it won't go that far, it'll sort of finish about there so that I can put a hole with a thread in there. You'll see it. that'll all become clear anyway as uh, time goes on but this is what we're making today anyway so let's get over to the uh, mill and, and get this uh, stock squared up. clamp up on a little piece of aluminium just to take out any variations in, in size so to make sure they're all clamped anyway. got them milled down a bit. I'll just uh, deburr all the edges and then I'll be back. I've decided to try and mill them all at the same time. We'll, we'll see how that works out. <laughs>
didn't work out too bad. Obviously, if they were meant to be precision items, then uh, I would have done it differently. I'd probably done them individually in a proper jig. There we go. It's got a little chamfer on this way now. Um, I'll put a little chamfer the other way. Um, using a tried and trusted method. Alright, because I want this to be repeatable on the other side, then I need to um, agree on a bit of an angle. on that side, flip them around and do the other side. cut the slots now, drill the holes for the bolts that are going to come up from underneath to aid the uh, clamping process. All right, it was at this point that the, uh, the cheap Chinese cutter failed. I'm guessing it didn't like plunging but uh, they don't really like anything so anyway I haven't got uh, uh, another nine millimeter cutter in a, a good quality so I've had to change up to a a 10 millimeter two flute because they'll um, accept the plunging a little bit more. Just cut those other two, these two, and then I'll bring you back. That's all of the slots done. Just going to drill the holes in the back now and then um, tap those and uh, tap a thread in and clean them all up, and then we'll be done. Sorry I had to move the camera, the uh, 
wheel on the table was uh, hitting it when I was trying to adjust the table. Alright, that's all the holes drilled. I'll just get the uh, 6mm tap in there. Alright, it is a machine tap, so let's uh, see how it goes. <laughs> mm. Well, that tells you something, doesn't it? <laughs> that tells you something. 1464. Really? Mm. <laughs> I'll get these cleaned up, uh, including the one that came out. We'll get them cleaned up and uh, then I'll be back to show you them. There we have them. Four little clamps for my fixture plate. I'll show that in a minute. they have got the holes in here for an M6 screw which comes up from underneath and then you've got the four screws, the hold down screws. Um, I'll show that in the clamp with something fixed in shortly but um, there you have it it's, um, yeah quite pleased with how they turned out that's all folks I hope you enjoyed the video if you did hit the like button I would also appreciate it if you would click the subscribe button because that will uh, enable me to grow the channel so that I can keep making these videos please leave a comment or a question I do read all of the comments and reply to as many as I can. Thanks for watching.